Hi everybody, it's Boaz Faller and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for Thursday, April 21st, 2016. The moon is almost full, Passover is almost here. Passover is the Jewish holiday signifying spring. Okay, so tomorrow we are celebrating Passover. Tomorrow the moon is going to be full. Jewish holidays always take place on a full moon. And we're still with the moon in Libra. Today the moon in Libra will oppose Uranus. It's a time in which we could be more rebellious. We want things to uh, renew. We want to try something else. We want to be ourselves and not lose our authenticity. And this is all great, but not at any price. We need to have some considered action today. Okay, because this opposition to Uranus can make us a little erratic. There is a Queen Conx between the Moon and the South Node, and this again strengthens that considered action, wise and considered action, is the route to take today. Because if we won't learn our list, our lessons the easy way, we can learn them the hard way. And then there's a Queen Conx to Chiron telling us, listen you guys, you all have things in you that emerged from painful experiences that created trauma and they're wobbling and waddling inside of you, creating their own little infections that create emotional reactions and behavioral patterns that you're still carrying with you for a very long time and that prevents you from really truly being happy and going forward in your life and today it's a time that we should cleanse those out doing some cleansing you know and and Passover is a lot about cleansing so in a way it correlates to what's happening in the skies today cleanse some things out take some of these pains heal them and and go on without those chains really burning, burdening your feet. And then at around 1300 hours Central European time, that's around 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, the moon becomes void, of course. So if you are in America, most of your day, the moon is void, of course. Mercury, the planet of communication, is still sextiling and trining the nodes. Our communications can flow easily and beautifully. Venus is still conjuncting Uranus, squaring Pluto, it's a time of renewal, of update uh, in our relationships and of change. And we want that change to be a beneficial one. So, thank you for listening and I'll see you all tomorrow. This is Boaz Feiler. Goodbye.